Hi guys, welcome to Matsy. It's me, Miss Messi, your teacher for today. So today we're going to transform general to standard form equation of a circle. So let's do first the long method. Squared plus y squared minus 2x plus 4y minus 4 equals 0. Let's do the addition property of equality. So, x squared plus y squared minus 2x plus 4y is equal to 4. So, what happened there is you just transpose negative 4 to positive 4 on the other side. Next, let's do the regrouping by variable. Minus 2x plus y squared plus 4y equals 4. Complete the squares we will be needing more spaces x squared minus 2x plus blank plus the second binomial y squared plus 4y plus blank is equal to 4 plus blank plus blank so to get the missing third term for the trinomial you need to get the numerical coefficient of the second term in the binomial negative 2 divided by 2 is equal to negative 1 square that and you will have positive 1 next 4 divided by 2 is equal to 2 square that and you will have positive 4 so we have 1 and 4 copy that for addition property so if you add 1 and then add 4 also x minus 1 squared plus y plus 2 squared is equal to 9 so if you're going to check that x minus 1 times x minus 1 do the foil method and you will have x squared minus 2x plus 1 the other one is y plus 2 times y plus 2 do the foil method and you will have y squared plus 4y plus 4 let's get the center and the radius negative 1 you will need negative 2 and for the radius r is equal to 9 get the square root of both sides you will have 3 so that's the long method Formula. R is equal to one half square root of 
Fußball, das Fußball, alles ist dabei, dann voll, dann ist I. Ich gehe es mir wieder wie sehen, I, weil wenn er die Feuer ist, dabei ist dann. Jetzt selbst die Chip-Dabei ist. Sie ist negativ du. Square that. I ist positive for. Square that. Wenn es dabei ist dann for, dann ist negative for. For I. So one half. Square it up. Negative two. Times negative two is positive four. Plus. Four times four is sixteen. Negative times negative is positive. Four times four. Still sixteen. So what will be the... Sum. Four plus sixteen is twenty. Plus sixteen is thirty-six. So what is the square of thirty-six? We will have six. So multiply that with imaginary one. As the only equal. Six divided by two. Is equal to? Let's have another example for the long method. How about 3x squared plus 3y squared minus 2x plus 6y minus 9 equals 0. So notice that the first term and the second term is not the same as the general equation. So you need to make this numerical coefficient equal to 1. So divide the whole equation by 3. 3x squared divided by 3 is x squared plus 3y squared divided by 3 is y squared. Negative 2x divided by 3 is negative 2 thirds x. 6 divided by 3 is 2y. Negative 9 divided by 3 is negative 3 is equal to 0. After dividing, we proceed to the addition property. So, x squared plus 2y squared minus 2 third x plus 2y is equal to positive 3. So, we need to transpose negative 3 to the other side. Next, let's try to regroup x squared minus 2 third x is the first group the second group is y squared plus 2y is equal to 3 so next let's have the completing of squares so to complete the squares we need some spaces so x squared minus 2 3 x plus blank y squared plus 2 y plus blank is equal to 3 plus blank plus blank the second term of the binomial so negative two thirds divide it by two is just the same as multiplication so negative two thirds two over one or the reciprocal of two over one is one half so that will be cancelled negative one third after getting negative one third square that so the answer is negative becomes positive one over nine so for the second group two divided by two is equal to one square that is still positive one so copy that to have addition property 1 over 9 and positive 1. The factor of x squared minus 2 third x plus 1 over 9 is x minus 1 third square. To check that, you need to do FOIL method. And the other one is y plus 1 squared. And you need to get the LCD which is 9. 9 divided by 1 is 9 times 3, 20. 
7. 9 divided by 9 is 1 times 1, still 1. 9 divided by 1 is 9 times 1 is equal to 9. So, 9 plus 1, 10 plus 27 is 37 over 9. And then copy x minus 1 third squared plus y plus 1 squared. So if this is negative 1 third, the additive inverse is positive 1 third for x. And for y, positive y becomes negative 1. So for the radius squared is 37 over 9 so to get the square root of the whole thing r is equal to square root of 37 over 3 that's the radius for the long method so let's use shortcut method this time 4 3 x squared plus 3 y squared minus 2 x plus 6 y minus 9 equals 0 so notice the first two terms are not equal to 1, so we need to divide this by 3. So what will be the equation now? x squared plus y squared minus 2 3x plus 2y minus 3 equals 0. So this time, we will use the center formula that I gave you a while ago, which is negative c over 2 and negative d over 2. To get the center, we need to have the value of C and value of D. So in here, the value of C is negative 2 -third. The value of D is positive 2. Substitute that negative times negative 2 third divided by 2. Next, negative times positive 2 over 2. Negative. negative times negative is positive 2 third over 2. Negative times positive negative 2 over 2. Next, how do you divide 2 thirds divided by 2 over 1? It's just multiplying 1 half. Negative 2 divided by 2 is negative 1. So, cancel this, we will have positive 1 third. Negative 1. So, now, as our center. Negative 3. So, let's substitute. Negative 2 thirds. Square that. Plus 2 square. Minus 4. Constant 4. Minus. Negative 3. Negative 2, distribute that. Positive 4 over 9. 2 squared is 4. 4 times 3 is 12. Negative times negative is positive. 1 half. Square root of 9 is our LCD. 9 divided by 9 is 1 times 4. Still 4. 9 divided by 1 is 9 times 4. 9 equals 7, 36. 9 divided by 1 is 9 times 12. Is equal to 108. R is equal to 1 half. Add the numbers, you will have 148 over 9. Factor of 4 and 37. To get the perfect square, no? So, square root of 4 is 2. Square root of 9 is 3. So, cancel that, we have square root of 37 over 3.